I got broads in Atlanta, Jesus the lean in the family, credit cards in the scammers, hitting the licks in the van. What's up guys, my name is Kryptonic and today I'm back with another Grand Theft Auto video and this video is going to be talking about the Piff there 811. So if you guys do end up enjoying the video, remember to leave a like and a comment down below and anyways guys, let's get straight into the video. So they recently added the Pifter into Grand Theft Auto Online and this car, although it might not be the fastest, meaning that the Grotti X80 is still the fastest car in Grand Theft Auto 5, the Pifter still has the most amount of traction, meaning that it's better for driving in general and I would say races overall over just being on a straight path, which the Grotti X80 definitely takes over. But the Pifter in a like actual race where you're going to have to be turning a lot and you know a lot of movement in there, you're going to want to go with the Pifter over the Grotti X80 because the speeds aren't that far apart. So, I mean, you're not losing that much speed unless it's a straight drag race. You're going to want to go with the X80. But if it's a, like a race, a normal race, the Pifter is definitely the better car to go with because although it's not the fastest, it's pretty good and it has really good traction. Now, this car does seem a lot more solid and a lot more stable than the Grotti X80 just because, like I said before, it has more traction and it is better moving in general on the track, meaning that you won't easily lose a race with this car over the Grotti X80, which is a little bit hard to control just because of how fast it goes. And with this car, it goes practically a similar speed, but it is a lot more easier to control. Anyways, guys, that's all I wanted to tell you guys that if you guys are interested in a very fast car, Grotti X80 is definitely the way to go in a fast drag race. It could win in a normal race. You just have to learn how to control it. If you want to be able to drive a car that's easily controlled in a normal race, the Pifter is definitely the car you're going to want to go with there because it's just, you know, overall almost as quick as the Grotti X80 and it can easily outdo many other cars, but you know, it has better traction and it's just overall better for races. Anyways guys, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and if you did, remember to leave a like and a comment down below. Hopefully you guys have a great day and I'll see you guys around and I'm out. Peace guys.